Hey, how's it going? That's okay, you know me. Well, well, if it isn't the golden half pint. And who is this, friend of yours? This is Sean. She's a makeup artist. Oh, that explains it. She certainly doesn't look like a model. And with a dress like that, you really look like two of a kind. I'm glad you noticed. Sean really does look perfect, doesn't she? I think if it were anyone else dressed as a mermaid, I'd be more likely to throw her back overboard. Do you have any new campaigns coming up? I've noticed they've started taking down all the Golden Princess posters at the mall. I'm afraid I can't talk about it. You know, those pesky non-disclosure agreements. Aw, that's too bad. I really hope we'll get to work together someday. It's just so frustrating with this exclusivity agreement I have with Cosmo Love right now. I mean, it's just one shoot after another, but having the same client all the time gets so boring. Of course. Congratulations again on your latest. If you'll excuse us, I have to go find Maddie. Just a friend. That's just how it is. It's hard to make friends when jobs are few and everyone is a rival. We try to be friendly, but it can be rough. I think most of the girls are still a bit sore about the Golden Princess thing. Big contract. Maddie was cast first, so they were looking for someone who resembles him. That and the whole dating thing <laughs> really annoys them. Which is the best part, really. Oh, and here's the lady killer himself. You two look radiant together. Oh, you. Stop flattering us when you're obviously the most beautiful person here. You're making us feel inadequate. I didn't mean to. Watch out, Sean. He's a vampire, and he'll steal your heart if you get too enamored by him. Hey, don't say things like that. It was your idea for me to wear this anyway. Yeah, I know. I have the best taste, don't I? But let's be honest. I'm pretty sure anything would look good on him. Why are we even talking about this? Fine, fine. No more teasing. For now. It's your turn to get your photo taken anyway. Of course. And there he goes again. Cool as always. It can get frustrating after a while, but I don't know. I guess if you love someone, it's worth it. There's not that much to envy. Uh, oh, thank you. Sorry, I I'm just not used to someone being so honest with me. It makes me feel kind of guilty. Maybe we can talk about this some other time. Sadly, I have to go mingle. Care to come with?
Oh, Sean! It's good to see you again! And then it's all business. We totally need to hang out in our downtime. Digits here, please! All right. And now you've got my number. Call me sometime and let's hang out. Laters. Miss Gooden, I'm pleased to inform you that your grades are acceptable to keep your grant. Good work. I wish you the best of luck in the upcoming month. Whoa! Sean! John, 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 John. It's snowing. I've never seen snow before. Let's go outside. <laughs> this is fun. Enjoying the first snow of the year? Yes! How come it's melting? See how sunny it still is? The ground isn't cold enough for the snow to remain frozen. Don't worry. In a few days, the weather will have ideal conditions for the snow to stick. When the snow stays frozen on the ground and begins to pile up, we say it's sticking. You two have never seen snow before, have you? We've seen volcanic ash in the air. Does that count? Well, enjoy this as much as you can. Some of the students from up north probably don't think anything of it. Why? This is the most amazing thing ever! Just be careful. The roads can get dangerous once the snow begins to stick. You two take care. Good work today! Sean, what are you still doing here? You should be home and tucked away in your bed. I wish I could give you a ride, but I'm already running late for a flight I have to catch. Time for another meeting with the network execs. Some things just have to be done in person. There's a break room in there with some blankets and pillows. You can spend the night in the studio if you want. Oh, sweetie, the break room is there for precisely this reason. If you're lucky, you'll find a frozen piece in the fridge. Anyway, I've got a jet, literally. See you soon.
Whoa, um, hey. Yeah, no, I'm fine. Just couldn't find my phone. Turns out I shut in my guitar case. Aren't I? Anyway, what's up? Whoa, it's late. Yeah, sure. You're at the TV studio, right? I'll be there soon. What's going on? 